Oh, Heinberg. Oh, spread out. Heinberg. Mr. Feinberg. Mr. Feinberg. Ah, oh, Mr. Feinberg. So good of you to join us. I'm sure you're wondering why I've brought you here. I guess. No, you can't, because you're an idiot. You see, my father was an infamous fellow. Hijacked nuclear weapons, early super plagues, robbed the strategic helium reserve. That sort of thing. The only thing he left me, besides the deed to these two henchmen, is a need to know why somebody would want to wrong me. The relatively infamous Rupert Manley. I've never heard of you. Shut up! Do you know who my father is? George! But Damn before it. I have George and Roosevelt turn your intestines into tiny condoms, and then stretch those tiny condoms over their heads and rob a liquor store, oh. I want to know, how is it that you came about, my idol? Well, I was walking home from the liquor store and I just found it in front of the school. Ah yes, the school. I was there earlier today, it's just starting up again and it's still hot enough for the boys to be. Wearing shorts. Right. I was fascinated by the idol. Mainly, which airport it had been purchased from. It looked like that sort of thing that you get on a business trip for that kid that you don't really love. Or maybe just don't understand. Right. So anyway, I was almost home when I decided that I didn't really care about it. Oh, so this isn't the real idol then. Roosevelt! Hey, 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 whoa, 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 Jesus, God, no, wait, God, oh, God, oh, wait, 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 I was kidding to that, I was kidding to that. Anyway, I got home. Well, I guess that's why they call it testicular cancer. <laughs> In other news, local eccentric billionaire and suspected serial flasher Rupert Manley released a statement regarding an artifact he claims was stolen from his house. It was a spectacular idol that my father brought home on his return trip from Honolulu, back when I was an innocent eight-year-old boy with supple, milky white thighs just went on for miles and miles. <laughs> Where's the nearest park? He is offering a million dollar reward. A million dollars? <laughs> Another hilarious news. A million dollars?
Greetings. Yeah, I have the idol. Why don't we make an exchange, you know, for money? Of course. Where would you like to meet? Uh, 7th and Washington, northeast corner. All right, fine. How much are you asking? One, two, a hundred thousand, million. Two hundred thousand million? That's not even a number you can say properly. Whatever, two million. All right, fine. It sounds like a deal then. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Be there or the idol gets it. But that's not the way things turned out, is it? <laughs> Jesus Christ, whatever. So then, Mr. Feinberg, what did you do next? Well, I party the only way I know how. I'll be taking my idol now, Mr. Feinberg. But I... I need... But... It, it, it. 